I, I think it was a difficult and chaotic and frustrating debate, which is about where we are in terms of the Democratic primary process to begin with. So if you're coming in, it was it was a decent entry point to the way the contest is, is going at this point. I think... If, Do you think CBS intentionally was <laughs> modeling it? <laughs> it, was, it was meta. They, 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 yes, they were, they were, they were trying to, to mimic the actual feeling of being one of us, and, uh, and they did a brilliant job of it, I thought. It was also co-hosted by Twitter, so this does yeah. feel a lot like Twitter. You know what? That Twitter makes debate. perfect sense. I, okay, I think, you know, if Mike Bloomberg had spent as much time workshopping his answers on stop and frisk and the offensive things he said to women instead of the naked cowboy joke, he could have he could have maybe redeemed himself a little bit. I didn't see, I mean, I didn't see him being the same punchline that he was last time, but I didn't see him doing himself any favors or winning well, back any votes that it, way. He wasn't an embarrassment to himself the way yeah, he was yes. the last time. The, he the was one, a different kind of embarrassment. He was a different kind of embarrassment.